Good evening everyone. In this video we will have a yes or no reading and playing cards will show us yes or no and the tarot card will tell us why yes or no. So if you'd like to participate please think of a question yes or no question like will I be rich, will I succeed in my job, will I um, will I pass the interview, uh, does he love me, anything and choose your set of cards. I have five. One, two, three, four, and five. And take your time, please. Okay. Are you ready? So let's have a look at our set of cards number one is it a yes or a no okay so <clears throat> it could be that you are asking about uh, an emotional situation or maybe love maybe the beginning of love maybe one-sided love affair or something like that and we have we, we might have an argument or something like that coming in here Problems, emotional problems, yeah. Uh, for some people, it can be um, even um, health problems, yeah. So the answer is yes. Um, if you ask about health, you will heal. If you ask about relationship, you will reconcile. If you're asking about another emotional situation, it says you will <clears throat> have another ch chance in succeeding in that situation. Also, we we can have uh, information uh, that talks about some sort of reconciliation, yeah? Like, uh, if you're in an argument, you will talk again and you will reconcile. So I'm getting that. If there are problems in the house, everything will be fine. Now let's see why will it be fine, what, what, which element will it be that will decide. Three of Cups, well, basically it can be uh, um, people support, friends support, family support, um, it can be some sort of festival will happen, function, marriage or engagement even, <coughs> it can be Christmas or anything like that. So through that festival I'm getting through gathering of these people, everything will be Okay, if you're asking about a wedding, it will happen. If you're asking about a function, it will happen. Because we see it happening. Okay, let's have a look at our set of cards number two. Is it a yes or a no? Okay, so these cards <clears throat> might talk about some bad luck. Uh, when it comes to achieving some goals, perhaps, uh, some financial goals, or simply in uh, gaining some success somewhere, like can be financial success, can be um, like respect, honor, and things like that, can be travel for some people. So let's say you tried it before, it didn't work out, so now you're thinking... Um, maybe you're doing the right efforts here with the Ten of Wands. You're actually not sitting and crying. You're actually doing something about it. And uh, the cards are successful. It shows lots of money in the end. Lots of satisfaction, contentment, and things like that. You can also talk about big shops, big uh, businesses, big... Mm, something <coughs> and why will you succeed you will do you will perform the right sale um, um, there'll be some sort of, of financial interaction maybe a deal that will solve this pro uh, this situation that will help with money usually for me it's like sales yeah selling something buying something so, some sort of financial business negotiation, maybe a piece of work, literally work, um, 
will help you succeed here. Okay. Let's have a look at our set of cards number three. Is it a yes or a no? Again, we have a yes here. <coughs> Sorry about that. We have a yes here. We have uh, okay two kings. Maybe you're talking about business deal. Maybe you're talking about um, buying something new, or it can be also a wedding. Maybe you want to buy something. Yeah, Ace so of it can be that you want. Uh, you're looking for a letter from some person. It can be that you're looking to buy something expensive. It can be that you want to get married with someone. So if you th thought of any of these questions, the answer is yes. We, we have that uh, letter or cash or a wedding or something like that. Now why, will it, why is it a yes? We have the Queen of Rods. Uh, it can be that you yourself will do it. It can be that... Um, your persistence, your actions will bring you this luck, this success. It can be that it's some other woman who will help your best friend, some advisor will encourage you. If you're a male, you're asking, will she marry me? It can be that she will say yes. That's why it will happen. And is, this is a... Um, you know, also it can be that you will be very good at the business that you're doing and you will make the right decision that will bring those that success also. Like it's in the in the hands of a woman. Yeah, the right strategy, the right scheming, the right uh, some sort of um, maybe research or the right... Um, you'll be very smart in this and that will bring you luck. Okay, let's move on to our deck, set of cards number four. Is it a yes or a no? Oh, this one is a no. And this one is a no, unfortunately. So, what we're having here, well, we have efforts here with the seven of clubs. Some sort of efforts, some sort of negotiations, maybe trying to do something to beat somewhere, uh, to get somewhere. And it's just um, not happening. Now, maybe you will abandon it, those efforts. Or maybe you did it before and now, right now, it's not happening. And in the future, you'll also abandon it. Like, I'm feeling like totally abandonment. Maybe someone else will abandon those efforts. Uh, maybe because of some lack of information. Maybe because of fear. Maybe because of you know, something else, maybe something is over in that area that we're asking, maybe someone lacks interest in in this, um, <clears throat> in this work or in this goal, in this action that you're doing, someone like gives up, and uh, why no? Okay, we have the world card. Well, definitely the world can talk about travel, international things. It can be six of swords, six of uh, spades also talk about travel, international and uh, interstate and, uh, you know, that sort of thing. And because of that, distance might be a problem here. Maybe the person left. Maybe it's a um, different country if you ask about work or immigration, something like that. Uh, it might be that is the policies of the other country that will not allow. It can be because it's international law that will not allow. Maybe it's, uh, you know, that sort of thing. So if you ask some other person, it can might be that the person left somewhere. Um, so, yeah, we have that sort of situation. Now let's have a look at our set of cards number. Five. Is it a yes or a no? Well, here I'm getting not exactly as you've asked, maybe, but I'm not getting a really no with the clubs card. So 
<clears throat> it can be a no because there's a lack of information, the lack of knowledge or the lack of reading, the lack of, you know, books that you read. Mm, it can be not the right time to succeed. Well, here it can be that you're asking about uh, some future um, goal or some about future, basically. It might be uh, about family as well or love or, you know, relationship. <laughs> like, will it happen in the future, our relationship or something? And um, this card talks that if you talk, if you talk with that person, if you... Um, communicate with that person it might happen but maybe you don't communicate you know that sort of thing so we have some sort of uh, almost like a no not yet or not now or that sort of maybe situation here <clears throat> so I'll go for a no here because we have a black card, let's see why. Look with the Ace of Swords. Ace of Swords might talk about, let's say, you want a relationship with someone, but you don't tell them how you feel about them. So you're not getting out of your comfort zone, and you're afraid, and basically not letting your, not allowing yourself to risk. And because of that, uh, I think um, it might not happen. You know, <clears throat> if you're asking about the person, I'm getting that the person might come, but you will still not be able to use that opportunity if you're in this situation. person might come for work, with business, but you would just not approach them or something like that. Basically, it can be a relationship situation, work situation, success situation, employment, anything like that. Uh, so, some sort of limitation, restriction will be there that will not let you uh, fully uh, achieve this goal. What you should do, I'm asking for advice here. Look, the Ace of Wands, you just should do it. Just go and do it. Don't think about how about your restrictions think about what you want and how to do it not what's holding you back that sort of situation okay this was our reading uh yes or no reading thank you for watching this video hope to see you next time have a great night and a great day bye bye